Welcome grade 7 students. Today we will talk about factorization by identifying or taking HCF. HCF means high common factor. All we know that if you have this statement 4 times 7 plus 5, I will distribute 4 on 7 and 5. So it will be 4 times 7 plus 4 times 5. This is called distributing multiplication. Now, if we have 4 times 7 plus 4 times 5, 4 is factor of this expression, and 7 is another factor. And here, 4 and 5 are factors. Where is common factors? Common factors are 4 and 4. So I will take 4 from both expressions. So it will be 4, open bracket, 7 plus 5 okay and this is called HCF high common factor okay let's perform this on variables and values factorize by using high common factor of the expression 3x power 2 y power 3 minus 9x power 3 y power 4 plus 6x power 3 y power 2 okay at first look to the coefficients the coefficients here are 3 9 6 okay 3 it's a factors 1 and 3 9 it's a factors 1 9 and 3 6 it's a factors 1 6 2 3 look to this 3 is common factor between 3 and 9 and 6. And not only common factor, it's the highest common factor, HCF. Okay, so I will take from coefficients 3. Okay, now let's look to x. Here is x power 2, here is x power 3, x power 3. I will take the lowest power, I will take x power 2. Okay, now look to y, y bar 3, y bar 4, y bar 2. The lowest bar here will be y bar 2. Okay, now let's see the first term. 3 divided by 3 equals 1, x bar 2 divided by x bar 3 equals 1, y, y bar 3 divided y bar 2 equals y. Okay. Second term, negative 9 divided by 3 equals negative 3. x bar 3 divided by x bar 2 equals x. y bar 4 divided by y bar 2 equals y bar 2. Okay? Look to the third term. 6 divided by 3 equals 2. x bar 3 divided by x bar 2 equals x y bar 2 divided by y bar 2 equals 1 okay so the high common factors of this term is 3x power 2y power 2 and to find the other factor the other factor I will divide each term by the high common factor okay second one Factorizing by high common factors expression 3a times 4, 4a plus 5b minus 2b times 4a plus 5b. Look to this 4a plus 5b. And this factor repeated here 4a plus 5b. So I can take 4a plus 5b from both terms. So I will take. 4a plus 5b okay look to the first term if i divide this term by this this term this expression expression sorry by this expression you will find the result will be 3a only because i take 4a plus 5b common factor from them. Now, second term, negative 2b 
times 4a plus 5 dividing by this expression you will have negative 2b okay let's solve this exercise 12a bar 2b plus 18a bar 3p bar 2 okay look to the coefficients 12 and 18 the high common factor between 12 and 18 is 6 okay so now a power 2 and a power 3 I will take a power 2 the lowest power b and b power 2 I will take b open bracket the first term 12 divided by 6 equals 2 a power 2 divided a power 2 equals 1 b divided b equals 1 okay plus 18 divided by 6 equals 3 a power 3 divided a power 2 equals a p power 2 divided by b equals p okay second one negative 2 x bar 5 plus 4 x bar 2 minus 6 x plus 2 x bar 3 now look to the coefficients okay it's negative 2 4 6 2 the high common factor of this coefficients is 2 okay so I will take 2 from all look to x now x bar 5 x bar 2 x x bar 3 I will take the lowest bar x bar 1 okay now let's look to the first term negative 2 x bar 5 divided by 2 x negative 2 divided by 2 equals negative 1 x bar 5 divided by x equals x bar 4 okay second term 4 divided by 2 equals 2 x bar 2 divided by x equals x look to the third term negative 6 divided by 2 equals negative 3 and x divided by x equals 1 fourth term 2 divided by 2 equals 1 x bar 3 divided by x equals x bar 2 okay number 3 4m power 2 times 2x plus y minus 3m times 2x plus y minus 7 times 2x plus y now focus in this statement you will see that 2x plus y 2x plus y 2x plus y so I will take 2x plus y from all terms so 2x plus y and open bracket the first term will be 4m bar 2 second term will be negative 3m third term will be negative 7 okay the last one 7 times 123 plus 7 times 35 minus 7 times 18 okay what's the common factor here you have 7 7 7 so I will take high common factor from all of them 7 okay the first term this term divided by 7 will be 123 and second term will be plus write the same sign 35 minus 18 okay equals 7 times 123 plus 35 plus 18 now this is will be 140 okay 7 times 140 equals 7 times 0 equals 0 7 times 4 equals 28 7 times 1 equals 7 plus 2 equals 8 so 980 is the final result 
of this expression. Okay? Thank you for watching and goodbye.